It's your boy Lagan24 coming at you with some Black Ops 3 zombies. What's up, every? Abade, what's going on, you guys? And welcome back to Dreisendrak. And today we're going to be playing the So Underpowered Challenge. Basically, all that is is we're going to be doing the First Room Only Guns Challenge. So, basically, all I could use, not basically, this is all I could use the RK5 and the Shiva. And the Shiva, those are the guns I'm allowed to use. And because they're like, you know, the starting room guns, they are historically two of the worst guns in the game. Now, with any gun, it's better when they're pack-a-punch. So the Shiva actually is not half bad once it's pack-a-punch. You get a lot of headshot kills with that. So that'll be one of the first things we attempt to do is get that pack-a-punch. Now, I didn't get, I didn't bring colas. I'm sorry, I didn't bring um, gum that I thought would make this challenge a lot easier. Like simply, I could have brought in wall power um and then just bought this and it would have been pack a punched uh but i thought that was kind of dirty i didn't bring perkaholic either and i think i brought some on the houses so we can get some free perka colas from time to time but other than that it's pretty standard gum pretty standard gum so let's see how far we can get of course i'll be going for my round 24 goal get past round 24 challenge is complete uh we'll see how we do we'll see how we do these are not my favorite guns in the world i'm just gonna do a little knifing to start her out start her out with a little knifing here and obviously we won't be uh, needing to do the... Oh my god, there's so many zombies right there. Where do they come from? Obviously we won't be needing to do the bows at all. Uh, so that's a shame because the bows the greatest thing ever. Better than the staffs. Hey guys, what do you like better? The staffs or the bows? Answer the question down below and let me know what you think. Alright, we're going to go ahead and buy our first gun. Let's do it. Shima! And we might as well get the RK5 while we're here. And the challenge has officially begun. Let's go. Eh. Don't give me a maxi ammo. Give me a double points. Don't do it. Double points, please. I still haven't gotten that second gondola to come up. Hey, thank you, though. The hot double points. You ask, you shall receive. So this gun's not horrible, but as you can see, it's already a two burst from medium range. Uh, I wonder if it's one burst from close up to the head. Nope. Sure is not. It sure is not. So this gun's already just crap, basically. But, like I said, with any gun, once it's pack-a-punch, it becomes okay. Like, this one becomes okay. If you have pack-a-punch and double tap on it, you're good to go. Now, my Shiva is completely naked. I don't have any attachments on it whatsoever. Uh, because I can't uh, put the attachments on it until I'm, what, level 20? I'm 16 right now on Prestige 8. So, uh, a little off. A little off for that one. But that's okay. It'll make the, it'll make the challenge better because... It's truly a weaker gun now. Hey, hi. Let's get a gobble gun. What you got for me, machine? Oh, we got a free perk right off the bat. Let's go. Eh, what's it gonna be? I say junk. You say stamina up. Stamina up. Yeah. All right, well, at least we can run fast now. I'm still gonna grab you. Because I like you. Because I like you. And then we'll get uh, double tap. Next, I think, as well. Go ahead and make these guns a little stronger. And then we'll eventually get our hands on Jug once we turn on the power. I'm spending all of my points instead of going to the power. This is not my... Yeah, I can't get that. What am I talking about? You can't just go around buying stuff without power on lagging. Don't be a buffoon. All right. Here's what I need to do. I need to get to power. That's that. So we're not too far away. I need some more points, though. It's going to be about 1,200, 1,300 shy here of opening up power. So, I say we camp this hallway right here. It's not a bad little camping spot while waiting to get the power room open. You just gotta watch this, uh, just gotta watch that, that door behind us, that, that window, that barrier, the barricades, the boards, this, that. <laughs> Something's wrong with me. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh my god, Netflix is like crack cocaine. It's like crack cocaine. If you have Netflix... I'm sure you've done this before. I feel like everybody who's done it who has Netflix. But binge watch, you know what that means? When you watch a show, like like you've never watched. For me, I've never seen Dexter before, and I really wanted to watch it. So, you know, I popped on season one, watched episode one. And I'm like, yeah, let's watch another episode. Not a big deal. And then a few hours later, you're still watching it. And then, of course, you go to bed, and the next day you pick up where you left off, and three weeks later you've watched eight complete seasons of Dexter. Shit, man. I'm not doing that ever again to myself. 
My life. I feel like I just now have my life back. It was it was so bad. It was so bad. Uh, well, the show was excellent, I thought. But uh, sitting there watching that much in that short of a span is crazy. Do you guys ever watch uh, binge watch anything? Like um, Breaking Bad's another one that I did. I, I watched most of that when the show was on, but then I went back a few a couple years later, watched it all again on Netflix, and of course binge watched it. And I keep saying I'm never gonna binge watch again, but we all know I will binge watch again. Oh, I never got the uh, actually never got the first shield part. We're gonna have to go back and get that. Shield is very important, guys. It's very important for survival. I hate dogs. No, I love dogs in real life, but I just hate these. Yeah. Back, Fido. Back. Okay, come on. Three more, I believe. Uh, got you. Got you. And you're next. You have been gotten. Excellent. Right, I need that other shield part from down here. So, we gotta go stand on all these pads real quick. Yeah, it's crazy being down here on round six. Normally, I'm down here on round four, filling up the last dragon head. I'm not used to playing this map without bows in mind. Like, your number one priority when you first start this map is to feed the dragons. Not this time. Not for your pal lagging. All right, cool. That was easy. Where's the shield? Was it up there? Didn't even notice. Let's see. Well, if it's not right here, then it must be there. And if it's not right there, then of course it's up there. Here. Oh, I should have teleported right there. Damn. I always build the freaking pack-a-punch out at the rocket facility, which costs points to get to and from. It's really not a practical spot for it at all. All right. We've got the shield uh, two parts. We just need to go. We need to backtrack a little bit and get the last part. And we are rolling Shiva, RK5, both doing work right now. Not too bad. Not too bad so far. Then I'm going to get enough points, of course, to get Jug and go ahead and put that in my belly. And then double tap. And then whatever on the house gives us after that, I'm good with. Don't really need Speed Cola. Both of these reload sort of fast enough. Kind of fast enough. You know, that part could have been right up there that I just walked past. It's right here, though. No, RK5. RK5, you're worthless. You're worthless. Oh, boy. Okay, I guess we'll go this way. What am I doing? I need to build the shield. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Whoa! Red screen of death. Run, Lagan, run. Yeah, that was that was close. That was close to being down. That would not have been good. I hate when I go down. It really, really annoys me. Especially on early rounds like this. Just very annoying. I open that, even though that's a waste of money, points. Go ahead and buy, do this. Go ahead and do this. Quickly, before the zombies come. All right, Juggernaut on my back. A few teeth out with this. Yeah, I just wasted 1,500 points opening that damn door. Could have gone out the roof and come back down here, but oh well. All right, now we're in a pretty good spot here where I can train it up a little bit, but I still need Jug money. This is... We're not safe yet. Oh, by the way, my freaking hot water heater busted a leak. <laughs> Got a guy coming tomorrow, but I spent all day... What was it, Saturday? Uh, basically cleaning up a huge, giant mess... Turning off the water, sealing up the, the the hose or the pipe that it's connected to. It's it's a whole thing. And now they're coming to replace the hot water heater tomorrow. Right, so yay! Boys, oh boy! Thought about going to a hotel, but I'm all good. I'm all good. Take a cold shower. It ain't no thing. All right, come on, come on. Almost have Jug money. She was doing alright, but I should have been using this for the points. Get a few more hit markers with this. More hit markers, more points, baby. Eh, gotcha. Give me that. Alright. I can't have that. Alright, Jug, 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 Jug. Go to Jug. It's hot as hell in my house right now. It feels like it's summertime down here. I think it's about 80 degrees today, which is weird. It's still March, right? Yeah, it's March. That's weird to me. This guy a friend of yours, Rick Toffin? I don't like when it's hot before it's supposed to be hot. Like, the winter time in Charleston, South Carolina this year was horrible, man. There was no winter. Like, every day was t-shirt flip-flop day. I mean, there were some cold days here and there, but I like winter time. Because 
I live in a very hot climate. So when winter comes, it's a nice break. It only lasts for a couple months usually for us. But still, I'd like to have it, and we didn't have it. It seems to have gone. Give me that. Danger closest. Okay. What are the rules of this? Active for three full rounds. Zero explosive damage. Well, that's not helpful at all right now. But thanks! But thanks! I'm glad I really took my time to pick my perker colas today. I figured those would be helpful during the panzer rounds. But... Uh, nope, because I got it on a non-panzer round. I guess I didn't have to pick it up, but I did. It's too late. Can't be undone. All right, so next step is to get double tap, and then we'll work on pack-a-punch, I, I believe. Almost had that double tap money. Ooh, zombie behind me. That's what the shield's for. I'm starting to realize that I'll train anywhere on this map, basically. It's... Uh-oh. Man, we didn't anticipate this, now did we? we Gotta go get some ammo. Luckily for us, ammo is super cheap for both of these guns. Now, at the same time of me recording this video, I actually have my computer. Um, so I've got like a triple, a triple monitor set up, right? Two computer monitors and then one for my console. So right now I'm playing this on console. And on one of my computer monitors is Mr. Dalek JD. He's live streaming right now. He's attempting to do the Easter egg. I'm sorry, the boss fight. With no perka colas, and I, I'm just dying to see how this goes for him. <laughs> it's gonna be a ripper Rudy fest. So the rule is, is that he's allowed to have perks to do all the steps for the Easter egg, but once he gets into the battle arena, he's gonna put himself down and then try to do the boss fight with no perka colas. That's insanity, and I want to see what happens. But I also want to record a video. So now I'm doing two things at once. Good luck, Mr. Dalek JD. You're gonna need it. You're gonna need all of it, my man. Give me this. Blunk, 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 blunk. All right, now we can work on Jug Money. Now, this gun just became a lot stronger. A lot stronger. All right, what round are we on? Eight? Not bad, not bad. Let's see, can we just maybe get another Gumball? Because I don't care. And then we'll then we'll work on Jug Money. I still have to open up downstairs so we can uh, teleport. Oh, Liquid Divinium! And all of its tightness has just joined us. Excellent, Liquid Divinium. Welcome. Welcome. Alright, so yeah, we need 1,500 plus 500 just to get out there. That's 2,000. And then we need 5,000 to pack a punch. So we need 7,000 points or 6,500 more than what we have right now. Or had a few seconds ago before I said right now. You know the deal. Oh, the air conditioner just cut on. It feels glorious in my house now. Absolutely glorious. Guys, do me a favor if you'd like to. Drop a like on the video. For if you do, here's the deal. I will send you all, everyone who leaves a like, let me know that you left a like, and I will send you a million dollars, each and every one of you. Bribery. Bribery for likes. Now, but if you are enjoying the video, please do drop a like on it. Put a like on it. Slap a like on it. Break your hand by punching the like button. You didn't do it right if your hand's not broken. <laughs> there you go. So underpowered. So, I guess with the title, though, maybe we should have put, like, a no, like, not allowed to turn on power either, because so underpowered. But it's too late for that. It's too late for that. I just didn't want to put starting room guns only, or Shiva RK5 only. It's kind of a boring title. So underpowered is much better, I think. I guess that's part of YouTube. Try to be creative with your titles. To entice people to show up to something they might not otherwise. And then once they're here, they may enjoy themselves. There we go. You're down. We're getting there. We're getting those points we need. We're getting there slowly. How are we doing on ammo? Nine in this guy. And plenty in this. I guess we'll use the Shiva this round. And we have 4,000 points. We need about 3,000 more for a successful pack-a-punch. Plus, of course, the teleporting, as you heard me all say that earlier. And I know that you did. Guys, today is Sunday. That means tomorrow is Monday. Anybody think... What was that? Oh, the trap. Anybody think that we're going to be getting DLC number two trailer this week? I, I mean, I would assume it's going to be on Tuesday. Uh, in fact, it's going to be Tuesday. <laughs> I don't know for sure. It's probably going to be sometime this week, though. And I'm here to tell you. I'm here to tell you that it will not be the island map that everyone's talking about with Takio. But instead, it will in fact be Stalingrad. 
And we'll be focusing on Nikolai. And that's the next map. And you can just deal with it, okay? Stalingrad. Uh, Southern Russia? Is that right? It was one of the most bloodiest battles in all of World War II. Pretty sure I got my facts there right. One of the largest and most deadliest battles in World War II. Pretty sure Nikolai was a part of it. But, you know, me and, you know, me and the COD story, zombie story, I don't quite know all of the details. In fact, I make up a lot of them. Nikolai was a shoe repairman, and, and he had one wife, and was very fa faithful and loved that wife dearly, and she died of a rare disease, and then he started wandering the world in search for his soul again, because he lost his soul when his wife died. Not literally, figuratively, of course. And that's when he ran into the other guys, because they were all soul-searching as well. And they decided to start a gang called the Soul Searchers. And that's what they're doing here. That's the zombie storyline. Nailed it. Round 10. Oh god, I have one bullet, and I have nine bullets. Okay. No one's really feeling like dropping any max ammo today, it would seem. But, good news is we go pack a bunch, and I will do that at the end of this round. Let me just get some more ammos. Well, in fact, instead of wasting our money on ammo... Oh, it's not really a waste. Never mind. It's not a waste because the ammo is so cheap. Let's get the ammo, and then let's head on out to the launch pad and do some, do some training out there, and pack a bunching. Stop it, zombie! Get out of my life! I'm gonna pop shock this damn uh, Panzer when he comes. In case you're wondering why I'm not, what did I come up here for? Oh, Jesus, lagging! What are you doing? I don't know. I came over here for some reason. I got completely sidetracked. Yeah, let's just open this up. It seemed important, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. of course, ammo. It seemed important, he says, confused, out loud, as he has no ammo. And then it suddenly dawns on him. Oh, it was ammo. So let's get that, shall we? Yeah, a little of this. Never hurt anybody. And a little of this. Never hurt anybody. All right. Everything's good. My God. My God! Look at my points. Six, six, six. Oh! Quick, get another point! Oh, uh, better not, better not. That's not the Shiva or the RK-5. I'll try to avoid by uh, picking up the death machine. If I do pick it up, I can just switch it out of my hands, no problem, so. Yeah, Shiva, you're kind of sick when it comes to headshots and double tap. You're about to get a lot sicker. You're about to get a lot more crazy. Yeah, I'm just going to run this uh, round up here, and then we'll go. We'll, t we'll take flight soon. All of the debris... Oh, did I not? Okay, hold on. That's right. We don't have to go out there yet. Well, we do have to go out there. But I'm going to send it to the Undercroft, actually. That's what I'm about to do. I'm going to send the Pack-a-Punch to the Undercroft. kind of like it there better than on the launch pad. It'll move randomly after you use it a couple times, so it'll eventually go back out to the launch pad. But for now, we'll start it at the Undercroft. Let's head on out that way. Alright, we gotta hit this pad while we're out here. Did it. Let's take the pack of punch parts. Oh no, I guess we did do it. Damn it. Lagging. Hey, Shiva. Hello. Now, should I stay and try to get the Ragnarok part? Would I even be allowed to use the Ragnarok? No, no, no. That defeats the purpose. That definitely defeats the point of the challenge. Although, normally I would say equipment is allowed, but not that piece of equipment. Good God, it's the Wonder Weapon. That's like saying that the... It's just, it's very similar to saying, like, the Apothecary Servant is a, piece of, is a piece of equipment. It's not. It's a goddamn Wonder Weapon gun. Okay. Well, so much for being underpowered. I'm gonna stay out here until I get another, another uh, Pack-a-Punch, though. And I'll pack a punch of the RK-5, then we'll head back. You can double pack a punch to get some uh, cool stuff on your gun, but uh, maybe we'll do that in a bit. But for now, I'm pretty happy with what we've got. And we got Panzer coming next round. And I'm ready for him with my pop shock, so no problems there. At all. Okay, provided I can stay alive, though. It's just when everything starts to seem like it's going your way in zombies. You see that little magazine flip he does? That's sick. Was he doing that the whole time, or just when I start when I pack a punch it? I'm not sure. I feel like, ooh, rocket test is beginning. 
Yeah, good for us. Didn't your mother ever teach you so just hang out in here for a minute. Yeah, this gun's way better. Way better, pack a bunch. And with that double tap on it. It's pretty ridiculous, actually. That's yeah, a one shot head, it would seem. I gotta call the tram sooner than later. Alright, we have enough for another pack a punch, which is great news. What are these guys up to? Just hanging out. Just hanging out, lagging. Oh my god, if I get 7,500 though. If I get that 7,500 though. Actually, go ahead and add something to one of our guns. Let's get the RK5 pack a punch. Nikolai sure there you go, buddy. A lot about going home. What color are we going to get? I say it's going to be blue. I even remember where home is anymore. <laughs> Nailed it. Blue. Beautiful blue. All right, let's shove it back in. Seems as Dr. A pack a punch from the side now because the gun never gets stuck. Work. You don't have to press the button 40 times. It just works. Turned. Turned. And the beautiful red pack a punch, as you can see here. It was blue. Now it's red. Of course, I'm joking, and I, I do know that this is blue and the other one was red, okay? Or maybe the other one was orange. I'm not quite, actually, I'm not quite sure. All right, 70 points. We're broke as hell. Let's call the uh, tram in. Panzer's on his way. We'll pop shock his face off when we see him. Where are you, Panzer? Oh! It's the ray gun! It's the freaking ray gun, you guys. I can't grab that. But it's so rare, that's only the third time I've ever seen it. And let me tell you, I'm not even going to worry about getting that uh, DG part from it, the, from him that he dropped. Because like I said, I can't build it. And going back down there, trying to fight my way through the horde, would have been rough. Would have been rough. Uh, it's too bad we had to leave the freaking ray gun behind. Are you kidding me? The ray gun surprise. I love that. I really, 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 really wish I had been able to get footage of that ray gun. A whole lot sooner. Uh, because that would have been an excellent video to make like within the first couple of days. But I could just not get it to come up. It just wouldn't come up. It just never would come up. It's like, nah. Nah, lagging. Alright, let's get some new pop shock. Because enough of that. Enough of that. Um, oh, hello. You're here now. Excellent. Alright, I'm going to try to find some gobble gum. Get rid of the pop shocks. See if I can get another on the house. And see if we can get a Perca cola Courtesy of Mr. Monty here. It's delicious gumballs. What'd you give me? Burned out? Okay, that's fun to use. That's kind of fun to use. I broke my shield. Gotta get a new one. Got it! Alright, zombies. This is kind of more of a casual uh, playthrough than like an intense challenge. Because this gun's working out to be pretty damn good. Uh, but it's something I would honestly never use longer than a couple of minutes if I got it from the box. Basically until my next box spin. And I would never buy it off the wall unless I was doing like a first room only challenge, which we're not. So, here we are. Yeah, that's pretty sick. It's pretty sick. I hate having turned on this gun though. I'm not a big fan of turned. Turned is very good. Don't get me wrong. It's just a round ender. All right, you got five zombies left. You want to dwindle it down to like two or three. You shoot them. Oops, one just turned, and now he's killing the rest. And the next round has started. Damn it! That happens so often. They're barking up the wrong tree. Is he still alive just standing there? What are you doing? There you go. Get out of my life, dogs. Your bark was worse than your bite, but... Oh, I used one of my burned outs just then. I'll probably use them. Get, let's get another perk. There we go. Take that, dog. Get another gobble gum, I mean. And from that, we will get another perk because here comes on the house. I'm calling it on the house. On the house. On the house, not on the house, in plain sight. This is bullshit. All right, new round just started. Can we buy another one? No. They counted that as round 14, even though it still said round 13 when I technically purchased it. That's not cool. All right, let's go Shiva. Let's go Shiva heavy this round. Got a lot of ammo between the two. Look at all the Shiva ammo you have. That is a ridiculous amount. I didn't even... Didn't even realize you got that much. Since it's a single shot, or a semi-auto, I guess you call it. Uh, 269 in reserve is a crazy amount. Especially since it does the damage that it does when you do headshots. I wonder how much it takes for the body shot on round 14. 
I'm gonna say at least two shots to the body. At least two. Let's find out. As soon as I can. Hold on. Just need to find a straggler somewhere. You. One. Oh, that was his head. Damn it. Good job. Good job. You shot him in the head. One, two, three, four. Four to the body? I'm not even sure if he's dead, actually. So it's not nearly as good when you're not hitting these headshots. But look at that, man. Just keep it up, bro. Oh, my God. Nice. We hit level 16. We got the CUDA so I can add my attachments back to my CUDA now. It's fantastic. All right. Nice, nice, nice. What do we have here? I'll take you. And kill him. There's one coming down the stairs. Oh, there's a lot left, actually. Get those guys. Get you. Suck it. Anybody else? Want a piece of Lagoon 24? No? Fantastic. All right, where's the gobble gum machine? The gobble gum can. All right, I'm just going to open this, because why the hell is it still closed? All right, we'll go back to spawn, where I think we will find... The gobble gum machine. Am I right? I am right. I'm always right. It's a gift and a curse. Don't you know? You no. Know, I think that color tasted different last time. Burned out. Come on. Don't no, want burned out. You know I want on the house. So I like playing. I like on the house. It's so fun because you just never know what you're gonna get. Damn it! And I just wasted one. That's all right. Let's get another gum. Let's get another gum. I can put a uh, soon. I'll put. An attachment on this gun, an element or something. Oh, it's gone. Wow. One round of gobblegum location now? That's weird. Well, where the hell is it at now? It's down below. It's down below, lagging. It's right there. We got burned out, so we can just stand here for a second. I ain't gonna bother me. Leave me alone. Sure. There it is, on the house. Hell yes. Alright, what is it gonna be, guys? I believe we got stamina. The first time, if it's Mule Kick, that's an absolute waste because I'm not allowed any other guns besides these two. I think it's going to be Electric Cherry. I guess we're going to find out in a minute. And by a minute, I mean like right Let's damn now. Oh, Speed Cola though. Awesome. Yo, On the House is being excellent today. Which reminds me, it's about time for another On the House challenge. If you've not seen uh, those in the past, it's kind of fun. The only way I'm allowed to get a perk is by pulling an on-the-house gobblegum out of the gobblegum machine, right? And then it's going to give you a perk. That perk could be any one of the however many perks are on that particular map, right? Uh, that was close, by the way. That was close to getting trapped. So if we play this map, there's nine different perks. Uh, so it could be one of nine perks. There's no guarantee that you'll ever get Jug. Uh... Or even all nine perks. I mean, because you have to keep hitting the gobble gum machine, which you can only do once around, and it rarely ever gives you back to back same gums. So usually you have to spin it a few times before you're gonna see on the house again. So example is we could get on the house in round one and then get something just random like Deadshot Daiquiri, and then not get another on the house until like round seven or eight, and then it could be like Speed Cola. So you're gonna, you're gonna like have dead shot and speed cola, like two of the weirdest things that you would you wouldn't buy those first. Well, <coughs> excuse me, some people would buy speed cola first. I know one person who would. Her name's Zeba, and she loves speed cola. 